morning. Today we're going thrift shopping, so I'm going to go around to Bunnings first. I'm going to grab some paints, then I'm going to pick Gabby up along the way, and then we're going to go hunting for some goodies at the thrift shop. So first I just wanted to say a huge thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I also have an outfit issue, so I'm going to show you that. <laughs> so here's the outfit. I bought it for painting. Here is it from the side. I'm gonna get some shoes on and then we can head off. But I just thought, what do you guys think? I didn't wanna look daggy, so I put a little button on the front as well. <laughs> I thought it was really cute. Um, but yeah, once paint's all splashed over it, I think it should look fine. I've just never worn something like this before, so getting used to a more artsy look. <laughs> So I just realized that I've got really fun socks that I've never worn. So I've got these ones. Ooh, does that go on focus? <gasps> Do you think that's gonna look ridiculous today? I thought I need to start wearing outfits that I can wear when I, um, when I become an art therapist because I need to wear clothes that I don't mind getting wrecked. And I've bought bits and pieces like this in the past where I'm like, oh, it's so fun, but I don't have places to wear them or outfits to wear them with, but I thought, this would be perfect for today. All right, if not, we're just going back to the plain white. I think that looks ridiculous because it comes all the way up my legs. Too much. I was just telling Gabby that um, this video today is sponsored by BetterHelp and we were having a bit of like a mental health chat you could say <laughs> um, and I was telling her about a few years back how I felt like I was probably in a bad space um, and that's actually when I joined the app for the first time yeah. because I didn't really feel like it was like I was in a place that it was worse enough to actually go see a therapist because I was like, yeah. a bit like, oh, I don't have actual real issues. <laughs> but I thought that I needed to jump online and use something that felt a bit, a little bit like low key, so yeah. easier. Yeah. So I'd actually previously seen that, um, I think it was like an influencer I must have seen that actually had downloaded this app or had promoted it on their platform. Mm. And they said like, it's, just like you can just text or yeah. message, oh, email. I didn't even know that. Yes. That's pretty good. So um, yeah. So if it's you don't actually have to go to the therapy sessions. You can just jump on your laptop cool. and do it from home. Um, and yeah, I thought, okay, well, I'll do the texting part because yeah. I was just like easing into it. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, that's how I found out about this company. So. Then I jumped on this time because Gabby and I actually both used to be um, students together doing arts therapy and I thought it would be really good to actually go through and talk about all the things that have come up <laughs> since <laughs> studying, um, which you would understand. Yep, it's very, definitely. very intense. It's basically we need to do like intense like self-discovery to become arts therapists because if you don't fully understand yourself then you could p potentially get like triggers when you um working with clients and there was a few times that i was sitting in class that you notice like people are crying or people are walking out of the room for yeah. certain conversations that came up and there was a few times where I just felt really uncomfortable and yeah. you weren't actually in this class but we were talking about things that I was just like quite like feeling like I needed to just get up and walk out the room so I just yeah. got like a glass of water so those are the types of things that I was like I probably need to talk to someone so yeah. I just matched up with a um, better help therapist and she's from America so I'm going to be doing it late nights to match with the time difference yeah. Um, and yeah, exciting to yeah. figure it all out. <laughs> yeah, it's very interesting as well that you can get people from across the world. Yeah. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I'll keep you guys posted. So do I think those scream 90s kids? And then Gabby got this like really good thing. Look how awesome is that? Yeah! 
Yeah, I was like, oh, sneak attack. <laughs> Last one is next on our list. Oh, what about a sticker table? It is very cute. Look at this. Great for those ones though. I really like these things. ones. Actually, you could do that. For the kids? Yeah. Okay. Oh, more boxes. Oh, oh my goodness. I need this. The kids. To go shopping in my store. Isn't that adorable? When they come in and they're like, Mommy, I want to do the small shopping. The small shopping. <laughs> So the vibe I'm going for is just like bright and colorful, but also like Harajuku, if you've ever gone to Japan and you've seen the street, it's like very kawaii and we're looking for things like Hello Kitties or um, like My Little Ponies and stuff like that and even Barbie dolls. So I'm going to go through the kids section here and see what I can find out of the toys. So I was going to go with plastic things that remind me of the 90s, but we found like a Domo see him? Domo! So we debated for like 20 minutes downstairs and we decided that we're gonna go plastics, I mean sorry, plushies instead of plastics. So oh there's Gabby! <laughs> Hello! So we're gonna go a plushy shelf above the kids section in the craft cafe. Um, spent a lot of money. You mean I have? Yeah. Oh. We did go to pillow as well. Oh yeah. I spent a lot of money there. Oh! This is a massive warehouse. What have you got? Oh, that's nice. That's lovely. Alrighty. So it's the following day. I've just chucked on the same outfit so I can start painting. Um, and I'm going to start painting all of the bits and pieces we got yesterday. So let me show you. These are all the things we got. So I wanted things that were like different shapes and I'm gonna paint them like pink and yellow and blue. I'm actually gonna put a mirror in this one. Um, I'm gonna paint the outside first and I just thought a lot of these things are gonna look really cool when they're painted. So this is what we've got to work with. I also just bought a sheet so I didn't get paint on the ground. Um, so let's get started and we'll see how it all turns out. about what could be coming every day we danced and life was smiling we were young and drunk in love a few years later i have started thinking if it's just love in every glass i'm drinking we're like one and without you i'm sinking i'm always shining But you show me life is full of faces Sometimes clouds got in our favorite places But we were young and unaware Oh, I got you, there's no reason to Chasing payment on my own Cause you're here to stay every night Bothering. 
Every day we dance and life's been smiling. We're not young, still drunk in love. I think I'm gonna finish up the video here today. So I just consulted Gabby on the phone and what we've decided is I'm gonna do some like paint, like slapping paint, different types of paints. Sorry, not different types, different colors of paints all over this one. Um, I've got my little candle here to show you that it's gonna sit about this high. So I'm gonna have these two as candle holders. Then um, these two, I'm going to mix paint and bicarb soda. So Gabby found a video on TikTok and basically um, it, once you paint on the paint, um, it then turns into like a clay ceramic kind of looking um, vase. So basically these two, this one was metal and this one was I think glass. And once you mix the paint with bicarb soda and paint it on, it will hopefully look like a ceramic um, yeah, vase. And then I'm going to do scalloped edges for this one. I'm going to keep this one the same. I'm going to keep those the same. It's just decorations. And then, um, I also got a green one and I think the green actually ties everything together. So I actually, I'm just going to keep the green the same. And that is all. So I want to thank BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I'm going to continue painting and I'll put up the final videos here so you guys don't have to watch me paint in the dark because the sun is going very quickly now. Um, but yeah, thanks for joining in and watching me vlog and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Time is up, nothing to do. You are gone, that makes me blue.